I was about to move on, but it seems like we are going to make a new friend. Before then, we have a message. Investigators just found the corpse of the cop that you spoke to in the alley, but she was found in a dumpster near corporate HQ, nowhere near where you left her. And while you reported gunshot wounds, this corpse was killed by an unidentified poison. Proceed with extreme caution. Before I begin to speak to our new friend, I have taken screenshots of all of the different alien species contained in the terminal. So if you want to read up about all of the different aliens in this game, you are more than welcome. Our new friend Cilia is a trisex. So they feature heavily in this update, so if you want to read more about them, you are more than welcome. Anyway, let's say hello. For a purple chick, she's pretty hot. Oh. Touch me and you'll be seeing stars. She is not joking. If we attempt to kiss her, she becomes violent. I will show this off in the additional dialogue video. Hey there, my name's Alias. What's yours? I'm Celia. I don't fraternize with customers. Just watch the show and don't bother me, Alias. Look, it's bad enough that I've got to do this lousy job. Gorb doesn't pay me enough to be charming. Let me guess. Jerry Lewis. With a face like yours, you could make really stupid comedy videos. Look, I get paid to dance, not to be an encyclopedia. Something tells me that she is not one to take orders, especially not from us. Don't push it, pal. So, what's a nice gal like you doing in a dump like this? It started back on you, Bleak. Trouble with the Akromati. They're really bad news. You know, they're tight with the Karpupu. Oh, a run-in with the Akramati. They're pretty tough customers. No kidding. My family had to flee the planet thanks to those jerks. Also courtesy of the Akramati. I don't know where to go next. I've never liked the Akramati. They put out a good public relations effort, though. That's all it is! They've enslaved my people and ruined my planet. Flee the planet? Must have been a big deal. Yeah, you could say that. What happened? A rebel leader gave us a package to deliver off-planet. The Akromati tried to stop us and nabbed the name of the contact. What are the rebels trying to do? 
The Acromati are systematically breaking up trisex families, enslaving them and taking over the planet. The rebel movement is trying to stop them. Your escape must have been harrowing. It was terrible. We were on the run and we were nearly all killed. I was grief-stricken over the loss of one of my mates. I'll... I'll never get over it. Celia, for the sake of your people and the movement, you must deliver this package off-world for us. The name of the contact is inside the envelope. Don't read it until you get off-world. If you're caught, destroy the envelope so the Acromati can't get it, and you won't be able to tell it to them. Only the contact at Helios Acrocorp can open this tube. It contains evidence to alert the corporate authorities to the outrages the Acromati have employed here. If the Trisects are to escape total slavery, the Corporation must know! Oh! You must keep the tube dry! Right, so... Tube stays dry... And letter must be opened when we escape, and not before. And one of our mates will die, apparently. Whatever it is, it was important enough for Wuna to risk her life to smuggle it off-world. I think so can't open it. Well, there's something inside. That again. It does not even look sealed. Okay, fair enough. No opening. Got it. Let's check out the map. So the map is. Definitely not static. Seems like we're going to have to escape somehow. And if we go to escape, I'm guessing it's going to be up river. Considering that this is a floating city. Let's check our log. Oh, use the QWERTY code in R mode to read these tips. Now, this is a puzzle for all of you. You may want to take a screenshot. I will reveal things as they go along, but if you take a look at your keyboard, at least an English keyboard, what you have to do is move each of these letters and symbols and numbers, to shift them one to, well, to, one to the left of the current character, so two becomes one, forward slash becomes a full stop, the P becomes an O, B becomes a V, etc, etc. So yes, look at your keyboard and just shift them from each character. So one to the left. Anyway, let's move on. I'll keep the map up for now. While we're here, we may as well speak to this gentleman. Well, I believe that it is a gentleman. Barman. Is that his name or his job title? He'll make a great mother someday. He's already a great nag. Mother? Okay. I'm not sure how this society works, but that's not my business. Mm, it reminds me of wearing nice fuzzy slippers. Okay, 
Fisk room and, uh, and then attack. Barman doesn't like it when I practice my martial arts moves on him. He gets all bent out of shape and lectures me about rough housing. Hey, barman, what's up? My blood pressure. You've been tracking dirt all over. Oh, don't worry about me. I'll just follow you around. Whatever makes you happy. You are looking particularly fetching. Danger becomes you. I hope there's nothing dangerous in there. What a great story. It's so moving. I believe lit cart stands for a literature cartridge. Well, isn't that nice of him? Seems like a nice person. I didn't leave it on, did I? Oh, maybe we can try again sometime when you don't have any urgent projects. Try what again? By Zelbo's big toe! Don't drink any! Why not? If you ask me, it's dangerous. He says the same thing about wading in the canal. Oh, no, nope. we are still ordering him. I wouldn't risk it. I might put somebody's eye out. I am worried that the Akramati are going to track us down. What are you worried about? I didn't get a chance to bake a pie to offer them, and the other things I gathered up certainly are not up to snuff for offering the company. Don't worry, barman. I'm sure we can get away without being caught. If they search our house, they're sure to leave an absolute mess. No matter what happens, sweetie, we'll be together and things will be okay. Well, that's fine, but if we go to prison, I don't have a change of underwear packed. Let's focus on escaping until we get caught. Then we'll worry about being caught. We've been saving money so that we can replace this antique with something more up to date. Oh, no. Excuse me, please, barman. I want to look at this fridge. No. Okay, I'll look at it in a moment then. No. Right, alright. Maybe like so. A barman brought that home last month in the hopes of having a romantic evening. I decided to spend that evening repairing the back steps. I'll have to leave that.
Barman's and your room. Money is definitely tight then. Barman's well-read copy of the Leaf Bridges of Madison Domicile Zone. Let's see. Francesco dropped the shallots in the water and reflected on the warmth of Sheila's breath on his neck, the strength and familiarity with which she had peeled the carrots, and the gossamer touch of Jimbo's delicate hands. Yuck, it's that type of syrupy romantic schlock that only a man would read. Forgive us? For what, exactly? An audio card of Narf Brook's greatest hits. Yes, it's got all the big ones. Stand by your men. Ain't no more lonesome in my threesome. Drive your barge into my heart. Akerty breakerty. Don't break my heart. Sure, since I'm such a big Narf Brooks fan, I think I'll do myself the service of leaving it behind. Parker? Well, as you may have guessed, this species is called the Trisex, and in the audio tape, three sums were mentioned. This society consists of, well, these people live in groups of threes. And if you read the terminal entries that I have uploaded, it will tell you a lot more about the society. It will definitely explain how they live a lot better than I could. But it does not explain why Barman and Cilia seem to be living in poverty. And this guy has got expensive audio equipment, a disco ball, a nice bed. Fair enough, let's get out of here. Right, is it fridge time? No, it's not. Okay, time to pack our things and leave. My best drill, but I'm worried that the batteries are on their last legs. All right, we are packed. Let's leave. It's a canister of ethane-based fuel liquids. Oh dear, I'm guessing that these won't be any use. 